okay, you're fighting Wrecking Ball, and you recognize this area. It's one of two burning cars in the area. You're going to come over here, and then you're going to move yourself into this area here. And this will draw Wrecking Ball over to you because he wants to kill you. Now, when he comes to get you over there, you're going to have to dodge around him and come back to right where I'm standing right now. In between these two bars, he actually gets me with a shot right here. I wasn't expecting that because I'm not that smart. But anyway, position yourself there. I go up against the wall to avoid damage. But now he has moved into that scaffolding area and he can't get out. But the fire from the burning car continues to deal damage to him and will kill him if that's how you want to do it. So he's trapped in there. He's going to continue to throw stuff at you, which obviously causes big damage. So a good location for you might be behind this truck. And then you can just kind of duck and weave in and out. It does take a long time, and some other zombies will come and attack you, which they're going to do if you're fighting Wrecking Ball out in the main area anyway. But this way, you can just deal with those little zombies while Wrecking Ball dies inside the scaffolding. And if you want to wait it out the entire time, that's your call. Or if you don't feel like waiting the entire time, just go over to the area where he's penned in, draw him out by getting to a certain angle where he can escape. And then obviously his life will be much lower. And you can take care of him with a few chops of the right weapon. 